Welcome back everyone, I hope you're all doing well. Today I'm doing a little bit of a collective thrift haul over the summer. I've been trying to reduce my overall consumption of clothes, so I just haven't been doing like as big of thrift hauls when I go to the thrift stores, but I found some pieces and I wanted to show you them, so let's go. All right, so we're just gonna start off with some denim shorts. The first pair, I think they were actually pants and I ended up just cutting and stressing the bottom. They were also a little bit too big, so I don't know if you can tell, but there are two darts right here that I just sewed in and then like adjusted the waistband accordingly. So they'd fit so now these are like perfectly tailored to my body These are kind of not like too short, but like they're not the Bermuda length. So they're perfect So this next pair of denim shorts has kind of got a darker wash and I really like the whole sort of like cargo style short trend So these cool little pockets on there and then the back I did kind of have to resize I don't know if you can see the darts right there. I don't know what it is, but recently I've been really into skirts So I picked up this denim mini skirt actually a skirt which is so nice it's got little like denim shorts underneath which i don't know why they have to be denim shorts they're kind of uncomfortable i'm just obsessed with this i think it's so cute and it's got this pink stitching all around it which is just so fun the best part about it is this like stretchy denim so it's very form-fitting but at the same time like comfortable and it's not like oh i can't sit down or the button will break so that's always a plus plus. and kind of to contrast that denim mini skirt i got a denim maxi skirt so this is definitely out of my comfort zone i don't typically wear like longer skirts but I loved the buckle detail here. It has little pockets, which is nice. And then it's got a little slit in the back so you're actually able to like walk when you wear it. Gotten much more wear out of it than I anticipated. And I think it's partially just because it's like a good looking denim and it just like is really easy to style, but it's not the same as just wearing like blue jeans with an outfit. So I'm a fan. All right, so next up we actually have a little two piece terry cloth set. Which I think is so cute. The high waistedness of the shorts, they come with little pockets, fantastic. And then the top, it's just the same orange terry cloth and it's just kind of got this tie top halter and then it's an open back. I really like it because you can wear it as like a beach cover up, you can wear them together or separate and they both look really cute. I actually found this set on Poshmark, I've never shopped on there before but I was looking for terry cloth sets. This one was like between $15 and $20 which is more than I usually like to spend but I figured because it's two pieces it would be worth it. And finally for skirts I found this maxi kind of skirt. If I wear it low waisted it's more of like a maxi skirt, if I wear it high High waisted it's more of like a midi skirt but it's just really pretty I don't know if you can see like the actual kind of like almost crochet details on the layers I just think it's really fun and I think it'll go with so much I've been on Pinterest a lot looking at sort of like Japan streetwear fashion and I've seen a lot of pictures of people wearing like long skirts like long flowy skirts with oversized t-shirts and I really wanted to try that out so we're gonna see. Moving on to accessories, I found this little New York Knicks hat at a thrift store. It was like a dollar. While I'm not really a Knicks fan, I've just been loving the whole like baseball cap hat look because I don't really like washing my hair, so just throw on a hat and it works wonders. Also at the beach, I've been wearing them nonstop. I found this really fun purse at a yard sale. Give me very much like Hannah Montana vibes. I feel like in the Hannah Montana movie, she's wearing a dress that's like very similar to this sort of look. I don't know what it's called. It's like giant sequins, I guess. But it's a really cute bag, I mean it'll go with everything, and it has a little zipper which is just nice so it's not like completely open and kind of have some like security there. I think it was like maybe a dollar, so. And I also found a pair of shoes. I always told myself I wasn't going to get any Doc Martens, and so far I've stuck to that, but I really liked the style of these. They're basically, I feel like what Doc Martens look like, they do have a zipper right here so they're easier to get on. And I don't really like Doc Martens because they're expensive, they take a while to break in, and they also are real leather, so this seemed like a good compromise. I just think they're really cute, and I wanted to kind of experiment with the whole, like, I don't even know if combat boot's the right word, but, like, look without having to commit to buying a really expensive pair of shoes. Next up. I found this little, like, bathing suit kind of top. To be honest, when I first bought it, I did not realize that it had, like, a sleeve kind of thing going on. But I just really honestly liked the print and the colors, this is what the back looks like. And the main reason I got it was because I love finding little bathing suit tops to wear under my overalls when it's really hot in the summer. So I feel like I could even wear it with a pair of like high-waisted pants and like a blazer and it would look like a top. So we'll see, we'll see how that goes, but I like it. I've been kind of experimenting with a few other online thrifting platforms, so I'm trying to stay away from Depop. But I did try Poshmark and then this is from Vinted. Um, which honestly, if you're looking for inexpensive clothes, check Vinted. The shipping is always like four-ish dollars and a lot of people price stuff a lot cheaper than any other of the online secondhand shopping platforms that I look at. So just a little hack. 
but I found this top. It's just got kind of the ruching um, detail and it's like a very nice stretchy material. I'm afraid it might be from a fast fashion place. I've never heard of the brand, but I don't know. I think secondhand fast fashion, while it's not being great, is definitely better than buying it directly from the seller. So I just feel like it's nice to have a good white tank top. And this one is just is like a little bit dressier, which I feel like is nice. I've yet to wear it, so I don't know what that means. So I did find one more little set. This is a men's pajama set. It kind of gives me like the baseball jersey look. And then here are the shorts. It was a size extra large, so I had to cut off the waistband and sort of sew in my own waistband and elastic, which took took a minute to do, I will say. But I just think it's cute and like with a little tank top or like bra top underneath, I think is fun. So this top is actually from the Goodwill outlet, but I just really liked it. I was really into orange for a time period, button up sort of, but it's more like snaps. My favorite thing to do is wear a little bralette and then just snap one or two. And then it's kind of open at the top and bottom and I just really like how it looks. And I think like this was a good find. A couple weeks ago I was thrifting with one of my friends and I found this fantastic Levi's cropped vest. I feel like everyone knows Levi's has exceptional denim, but I just love the wash of this. I think it's so cute when you're wearing them with jeans, especially high-waisted jeans, the proportions are perfect. So I just think this is so fun. I've been trying to get into layering and I feel like this is like a great piece for it. And then I found this fantastic like Wrangler flannel. I don't even know, fleece kind of sweatshirt. I am going to school up north and so it's so much colder up there. And I just figured that I needed some good like wintry pieces. I feel like wearing like a sweatshirt and then this over top will definitely keep me warm because it's lined with this like super soft, like fuzzy teddy bear material. And finally, last but not least, I've been trying to stay away from eBay shopping because I'm so good at it and I find the best pieces and I want to buy all of them but I had to splurge when I found this dress. I can't explain to you how much I love it. It's my new favorite piece of my whole entire wardrobe. I want it to be cold to wear it instantly. It is this gorgeous maxi dress. It's long sleeve. It fits so well. It's the best. It's my favorite. Um, it was, I think like 15 bucks including shipping, but so, so worth it because throwing this on and then those black boots is a look. I'm obsessed with it. I love it. And that's the end of the haul. So yeah.